Oh yeah, baby, take a look at this. I'm talking about the Goonies 2 here for the original 8-bit Nintendo. Now, since I talked about Friday the 13th, and a lot of people have mixed reviews on it. You know, people think that's actually a good game. <laughs> yeah, and I got some comments saying, it's not that bad, come on. Well, here we have the Goonies 2, which has a lot in common with Friday the 13th. Here we got action platforming scene, and if you go in certain doors here, like this one, it takes you to, yeah, a whole new 3D world. And since this is the Goonies 2, this is not only a sequel to the hit Hollywood movie, but it's also a sequel to the famous Famicom and arcade game of the same name. Yeah, the Goonies. It's weird though because we never originally got that game released on the original Nintendo. So, <laughs> a lot of kids might be confused. So if you wanted to play the original Goonies, you had to go to like the arcade or something. And since Konami was kind of late in releasing games for the original Nintendo, yeah, the original Goonies, they made the cut. Okay. Yeah, this is the big thing about Goonies 2 here, is that you can actually enter in these 3D areas. I'm in trouble without my glasses. Do you have any? Let's go to my tools. No, I don't have any glasses. So fuck you! <laughs> Please, help me! Alright, let's hit him with our fist. Ouch! What do you do? <laughs> oh, I love doing that. Alright, so we have to find some old glasses for the old man. And yeah, this game is just filled with items. Secrets. Alright, let's hit some. Nope, nothing here. Well, it's little secrets like this you can find. Like, if I had a ladder, I can go up there. <laughs> but I don't. So maybe I have to come back to this place later. Yeah, that's another cool thing about this game. It's not linear. Oh, shit. <laughs> Yeah, you gotta watch out for that guy. He has a gun. And this storyline, the Fertitas are bad. They're out of jail, and they want revenge on you. Yeah, Mikey is trying to find the other Goonies that have been captured by the Fertitas. Yeah, and they also kidnap a mermaid. Yeah, that's a big thing about the sequel. Yeah, they're friends with a mermaid for some reason. But hey, whatever. <laughs> so I love the adventure aspect to this game. There's so many different weapons you can find. Alright! I want to take that. Alright, and you have to conserve weapons too. Like, that slingshot is awesome, but it has limited ammunition. So many different areas you can explore. You can go back and visit old places again to see if you can unlock secrets that you haven't found before. And listen to that background music. Rockin' Cindy Lopper, baby! Yeah, that's so cool! But Cindy Lopper, she made a lot of cool hits back then. <laughs> you know, time after time, and girls just want to have fun. Oh, it really takes me back to the 80s, man. And that's why Goonies 2 here is so awesome. The game is pretty forgiving on the jumps, I would say. When Mikey jumps in the air, you can actually control him in mid-air. But the game is still pretty challenging too. Still lots of pitfalls, lots of different enemies you can fight. <laughs> it's a very cool game. Yeah, the 3D is pretty rudimentary. And yeah, sometimes the controls can get inverted. Like Mikey will be facing the other way when down is up and up is down sort of thing. But I don't know, you get used to it. Uh oh, where am I now? Oh, correct, yep. There, I pressed up and I went out. But see, the controls are inverted because he's looking the other way. Yeah, this game is just filled with tons of cool areas. You got lost caverns. You get to fight baby dragons. And the events you get to go to the hideout itself at the Pachitas. There's just so much variety in this game. Alright, so I'll wrap this up now. Unlike Friday 13, you know. Jason was highly overpowered, and it took forever to, you know, power yourself up. This game is more gradual in its difficulty. I think it's more brilliant that way. Whoa, crap.
<laughs> the Goonies 2 really hits it out of the park. It's just a much better adventure game. It uses passwords so you don't have to complete it all in one sitting. The weapons feel more effective. The controls feel better. I give it a 75 out of 100. If you're looking for a good action adventure game, you love the movies, or you love the movie growing up, I was going to say movies, but nope. <laughs> this is the type of game, because it has a license and all, that you won't see released on a virtual console. I guess when Konami had that license back then, they were able to make two games and that's it. And that's pretty much it for the Goonies series. Like, they got two games, one movie, and boom, the series is done now. Oh, it's crap, I died. <laughs> but that was my fault. Yeah, it's cool to see Konami make a sequel to the movie. <laughs> that would have been awesome to see oh, <laughs> the story on the big screen about them trying to save a mermaid. So yeah, if you love your Goonies, play this. Right. Kill the penguin. Yeah. <laughs> I hope there are baby seals in here. I want to kill them too. <laughs> you can't do that, nice climbers. <laughs>